Hi, boys and girls, it's Mr. Campbell, and today we are going to be learning about pictographs. Now, what is a pictograph? A pictograph is a graph that uses pictures to represent data. So the key to reading a pictograph is by always looking at the key. So think of it as a real key, it unlocks data. So we're going to look down here where the key on this particular pictograph says each soccer ball equals two goals. So if I was looking at the graph here, it says Elijah kicked one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight and a half soccer balls. Well, we know that you can't score half of a goal. Well, we have to remember that each soccer ball equals two goals. So we're going to count by twos. Two, four, six, eight, 10, 12, 14, 16, plus one, because there's half of one. So that would be 17 goals for Elijah. Now, likewise, Kate only had a half of a soccer ball, but if each whole soccer ball is two goals, then Kate actually had one goal. So that is how you read a pictograph. Now, let's look at an example. So if you were in class, I would have had you all do a survey, um, and then we would have done something with the survey. So I came up with the graph today for favorite pizza topping. Now, let's hypothetically say that cheese has got 12 Folks. Now, we would use our tally marks. There's 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. And we're going to say pepperoni got 10 votes. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. Green peppers, we're going to say got 5 votes. So there'd be just one bundle. Bacon, we're going to say got 9 votes. So we're going to do our 9. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9. And sausage will say six votes. So one, two, three, four, five, and six. Now, we're going to use this data to create our own pictograph today. So once again, we're going to say cheese had 12 votes, and pepperoni had 10, green pepper had five, bacon had nine, and sausage had six. And our key is going to say every pizza we draw is worth two votes. Now, we could get really detailed and draw very detailed pizzas here. But for the sake of time, we're just going to draw ovals that look like a pizza. So if we're trying to represent 12 votes for cheese pizza, we're actually going to be drawing six ovals. Okay, so we're going to count by twos. Two, four, six, eight, ten, and twelve. So six pizzas equals 12 votes because each pizza equals Two votes. Now, pepperoni, likewise, would have 10 votes. So we would be drawing five pizzas. Two, four, six, eight, ten. Once again, I'm making them all the same size so it's easy to read and see that cheese has the most. Now, it gets interesting when we get to green peppers because we have an odd number and each pizza equals two votes. So when you have an odd number, you're going to count by your, your evens as far as you can. Two, Four, but now we have one left. So we're going to draw a half of a pizza. So it's not the full one like up here. We're going to draw a half of a pizza to say two, four, and five. Bacon, same thing. Two, four, six, eight, and then we have that half. And finally, sausage had six. One, which is two, four, and six. So boys and girls, that's quickly how we um, draw the pictographs. All the work this week is going to be dealing with pictographs. So you're going to be asked to um, draw out some of these things or read that kind of data to answer questions. If you have any questions, please feel free to reach out to Mr. Campbell through email um, or through the, the Google Classroom. But I hope you enjoyed this lesson and you were able to learn about pictographs. All right, have a great day.